As you know, we made a, a change at quarterback this morning. Um, let me just clear up a few things. After the game on Sunday, I told you that Josh Freeman was our starting quarterback again on Monday. I reiterated that um, because he was. After I met with you guys, um, Mark Dominic and I spent a lot of time together and in some intense meetings trying to decide what's best for our football team. We got with our ownership when we came to a conclusion uh, as a group. We made the decision organizationally that we're going to make a change at quarterback, and now Mike Glennon is our starting quarterback. He in action sport today, and the biggest name is Josh Freeman, who's been the starting quarterback since the middle of the 2010 season and missed only one game since then. Greg Schiano decided to make a change with his team 0-3. Big, strong man that really sets the tone on that offensive line that wants to run the ball. And the former Olympic sprinter, Jeff Dempsey, in the lineup, number 32, his NFL debut. Lennon hit as he throws. Lennon gets time and completes it to Kevin Ogletree. Man, he worked with the line. Lennon, short drop. Gets it out to Tim Wright. No game on the plus. And is a running back. Number 30, Lennon out of the shotgun. Here comes the blitz, and they got him. Jeremiah Bell, a veteran safety. Lennon, the quarterback, Doug Martin, the running back. Lennon fires, and it's off the hands of Ogletree and incomplete. Lennon out of the shotgun from the 29. That's time, and completes it to Mike Williams. Sam, you know what I like about this drive? <laughs> Lennon with time. He throws to Williams. Touchdown! Save that football. Mike Lennon, first NFL touchdown pass. Two tight ends in for the Bucks. On second down, the play fake by Lennon. Rolls and throws, and it's caught. Up at the 48-yard line by Vincent Jackson. The box. Lennon, deep drop, plenty of time, nobody opened downfield. So he goes short to Tim Wright, the tight end. And actually, Ryan Leonard in the backfield now on third and eight. Pressure on Glennon, he gets rid of it incomplete. Fans wanted him, second and 13. Lennon gets time, swings it out to Doug Martin, makes a nice move. Martin gets up to the 43-yard line, busy day in the NFL. Here's Trittman. Alex Okafer. And Alex Okafer. Their draft pick out of Texas. On second down, Lennon's pass batted up in the air, and a diving effort for the catch by Mike James, the backup running for Tampa Bay. Lennon sprints to the right, looks, throws, almost intercepted. Dropped by Carlos Davis. The 14 yard line. Short drop. Lennon wants to go deep. Puts it up and it's incomplete. Well covered. Patrick Peterson. For the Buccaneers. Not the position you want your young quarterback in. Cardinals rush for that pass is complete to the tight end, Tim Wright. By the Arizona Cardinals. On second down, blitz from the outside by Dansby, and he got a piece of Mike Glennon. For first down now, on third and 15, the blitz coming. He's trying to set up a screen pass, and Martin is taken down right away. Good play by Glennon to the right side. Glennon, a little pump fake, waits, goes to the safety valve. Doug Martin, and the Cardinals have him covered. Take him down to his quarterback so far. So good. Great wide receivers. Brian Leonard in as the running back. Swing it out to Leonard. And he's got the first down. Good effort by Leonard. Brought down by the safety. The rookie. Leonard gets time. Completes the logo trade. Very close to the first down. This will depend on the spot. We've officially reached the two. Everybody out. Lennon gets time and completes it. Up to the and they're waving incomplete. The big hit by Jeremiah Bell, and there's a flag on the line. Some first down at their 43. Lennon sends everybody out. He's hit as he throws, and a pass is dropped by Mike Williams. Great. You don't want too many of those on your quarterback. Second and ten out of the shotgun. Pressure on Lennon. Gets rid of it. Connects with Mike Williams. First down. Yeah, they're 
Smith, the middle linebacker, to his teammates, the play fake. Lennon steps up, goes outside of the fullback, Eric Lawrence. Lawrence stays in bounds for the nice little cut. And it's across the 40 to the 41 yard line. I don't think he's so comfortable to sit on this thing. Bruce Arians, I'm sure, the play design, they can score 10 points in a row. And pass complete to Vincent Jackson. Once again, Jackson against third and six. Brian Leonard in the backfield with Glennon. Glennon for Leonard, makes a nice grab, and it's a first down. Terrific effort by the veteran seventh-year player from Leonard. He's an offensive tackle, he's eligible. Pass outside to Mike Williams, and he is stopped by Troy. Glennon works out of the shotgun. Late blitz coming, they pick it up. Pass to Ogle Tree, and he's brought down, looks like he's two in that season at New England. Glennon being pressured, get rid of it, and connects but short of the first down. So the fullback for the Bucks. On second and six, blitz coming. They fake the draw, Glennon gets time and throws! Intercepted by Patrick Peterson! He's back to the 15 and down to the 14! Out of the shotgun is Mike Glennon. Three wide receivers in. Glennon throwing, and it's over the head of Vincent Jackson. Patrick Peterson is on the to make the play. Third and ten. Arizona pressure on second down. We'll see what they dial up on third. Hard showing blitz. And Glennon in trouble, and he's brought down. He is brought down at the one-yard line by Dante Moak. Playing his first game for the from the 20. Looking, throwing, incomplete. Trying to get it for the tight end. Lennon seven for 16 in the second half. As time throws and completes it to Tim Wright, the tight end. Up to the 32-yard line of Mike can handle this situation here in the middle huddle in his last minute and a half of this game here. Up at the 33. Everybody out. Brennan gets time. Waits for someone to come open. Finally, he does. That's Kevin Ogle. Attacking for Arizona Cardinals. They need about 18 more yards to get into position to kick a tying field goal. Brennan hit as he throws. Intercepted by Patrick Peterson. And he goes to the ground. Patrick Peterson comes up huge in the fourth quarter with two interceptions.